welcome to my channel in this video we are going to discuss about a high pass band pass band elimination butterworth filters prerequisite you should have seen the low pass butterworth filter part of the filter contained first order high pass butterworth filter derivation for the gain equation second order high pass butterworth filter wide band pass filter stop band band elimination filter all pass filter first order low pass butterworth filter again in this case we have already discussed in the part 1 20 db per decade and uh, non inverting terminal we have given the input then gain is given by 1 plus rf by r and v1 we have written the equation in low pass we had a capacitor now in high pass we will be having a resistor this side we have a capacitor that's all this is the derivation what we did for low pass filter in the part one and in the high pass filter simply by interchanging the frequency determining resistors and capacitors in the low pass filter we get a high pass filter the circuit diagram only the R and C are interchanged, remaining is same 20 dB per decade, 1 plus RF by R1 into V1. What we will get? V1 I have to write equation, only the positions are changed. V1 I will get this. Gain is given by 1 plus RF by R1 into V1. Simply I will fill that and I will get V0 by V in equal to AF into this term, where AF is given by 1 plus RF by R1. FL is given by 1 by 2 pi RC. The magnitude of the voltage gain is given by this equation. Second order high pass Butterworth filter 40 dB per decade will get and uh, again when you compare the second order low pass filter only R and C are changed and the V0 by V in is given by AF by 1 plus FL by F holders to 4 and remember whether it is a high pass, low pass, if a second order is there, gain should be 1.586. This point should be remembered. Third order low pass filter will get by cascading a first order low pass filter and second order low pass filter. And the fall rate what you get is 60 dB per decade you will get. Fourth order if you want, we cascade second order low pass with a second order low pass, we we'll get a fourth order low pass filter and we we'll get 80 dB per decade roll off. Wide band pass filter. Take a time, this is a low pass, it is a high pass, now you need a band pass. How to Write the circuit using a low pass and high pass for the band pass. Pause here, write down in terms of blocks, low pass, high pass, try to get the band pass response. Pause here. Hope you might have written now. This is a wide band pass filter. Now high pass filter, it is a FL, up to this, above this it will pass everything cascaded with the low pass which will pass up to FH so we will get a wide band pass filter this is the way how you have to design in terms of blocks I am showing now high pass all of you know how to write low pass you know how to write for 20 dB first order you have to cascade those two so this is a high pass connected with the low pass first order this is a circuit diagram pause here try to go through now wide band elimination filter we know the low pass high pass we have just now discussed the band pass similarly now we have to do band elimination or band reject filter pause here and try to write down in terms of blocks high pass low pass to get a band reject it's a band stop or band reject filter I want FH and FL like that. So simply low pass filter and high pass filter I will connect 
output of these two to the summing amplifier. The signal I'll give to the low pass also, I'll get to the, give to the high pass also, I'll get a two separate these frequency response simply I'll add using a summing amplifier. This IQ diagram, high pass I have, low pass I have and summing amplifier. Pause and go through this. All pass filter, then name itself give the idea, all pass. It will pass all, then why it is called as filter? Different phase shift for different frequency you will get in case of all pass filter. Where it is used? In telephone lines. Signal may undergo change in the phase. To compensate that uh, change in the phase, we use this particular all pass filter. This is a circuit diagram and this is a phase shift how we get. So far we had discussed these things. First order, second order high pass, derivation of the gain for first order, wide band, band elimination and all pass filter. The reference book is Ramakan Gayakwad. For more information, visit these links. Thanks for watching this video. Share this video if you like. Subscribe this channel. Thank you.